government sanskari diktat indecent ads or moral policing should the government set standards for ads banning vulgarity or an awareness campaign regulate content not the message condom ad ban on epicenter tonight hello everyone good evening you have a problem with sleaze clean the sleaze but why kill the message in india where a woman is raped every 20 minutes where marital rape may never be criminalized for the sake of salvaging the crumbling edifice of marriage where a woman dies every hour owing to a dowry related reason where even a 4 year old child isn't spared from being brutally gang raped it is a simple commercial that is being perceived as a terrible cultural threat what a conceited lopsided world view that is we are debating that at the top of 7 i'm shreya dondial i want to hear from you this evening on the subject our phone lines are now open we are just putting up that board with the phone number uh, uh, for you there it is 0120434 do call us do call us if you have anything to say meanwhile in the other headlines a year after she died a video of j jay lalita sipping juice in a polo hospital in chennai is released by the ttv dinakaran camp on the eve of the rk nagar bypolls they say the video rules out any fishy business in her death after rejecting 22 counselor access requests pakistan finally granting visa to kulbushan jadhav's mother and wife the slated date of the meeting is scheduled for the 25th of december and a day after epicenter debated the suspension of a student for hugging in a kerala school the school now blinks has called the family for a settlement meeting this is an epicenter impact our top story first the government of india came up with a curfew on condom ads now the rajasthan high court wants to know what is the logic behind allowing condom ads to run only between 10 pm and 6 am a time when no one is watching indeed the question is what is the logic that debate is starting right here on epicenter after we tell you what the fuss is all about the steamy condom ad featuring sunny leone jab kuch pehli baar karte hain the former porn star at her titillating best the ad turned out to be the last straw soon followed a government ban after receiving numerous complaints the government decided to crack the whip banning condom ads during the day on tv only allowing them to run between 10 pm and 6 am it's the journey that counts not the destination now the rajasthan high court has issued a notice to the government questioning the logic behind the regulation The notice was issued after a human rights group challenged the government's decision, arguing that the move will prove counterproductive. It was principally challenged on the ground of arbitrariness that in a country like India where you need to promote family planning and you need to promote the means so as to curb the HIV, uh, you are banning the advertisement and it has a direct uh, relation to the public health and welfare and if the advisory is uh, uh, taken in, uh, to be correct then an ad which is Uh, uh, against decency till 9:58 59 pm suddenly becomes uh, decent at 10 2 pm so that is a uh, quite arbitrary and absurd and uh, the government has been issued notices to give reply why this advisory should not be set aside the government says that condom ads are indecent and inappropriate for children viewing hence the day ban but the social groups believe that india desperately needs more condom use not less India is the second most populous country in the world with a population of 1.3 billion people. The activists say that the government must focus on promoting condom use, which is less than 6% among those who use birth control measures. The message is clear for the government, regulate the content but do not kill the campaign.
yes the current crop of condom ads hardly makes for family viewing i agree to that but what is but is this the best way to deal with that to push them to a slot when no one is watching why kill a message that directly impacts a family's reproductive health therefore their happiness my guests this evening are promising a healthy and sane debate amber zeri is a social activist she's joining me here in the studio sanjana galrani is an actress we are hoping that she'll join us from bengaluru her line is still not through i believe uh, both are saying that this condom ad curfew is absolutely illogical on the other side of the debate shelly maheshwari gupta she's a former mrs asia pacific and acharya vikramaditya who is a religious preacher acharya vikramaditya uh, since you are the only man on the panel this evening and that's a rarity so i'm you, you should be the one who opens this debate what is your problem with condom ads being played on prime time television is safe sex not important for this country Certainly. is that a message that doesn't need to go out India is a culture where we have Kama Sutra, where we have Kumar Sambhav. We were never against the sex. Sex is a life, but sex is a sin also. You have to understand this thing. The way you are selling this industry is selling the sex. They are selling the sex. So you have to understand this thing. You are selling the vulgarity. Uh, why the government? This is a government initiative. Why you do you? आपने क्यों नहीं लिया initiative? आपके सामने वो ad चल रहे थे. आप देखें Sunny Leone को लेके आ रहे हैं आप sex के condom को बेचने के लिए. दूरदर्शन भी आपके माने वो चलाता था ad. माँ निरोध का एक ad आता था और वो इतना ethical ad होता था. Different different kinds of your message. You you want to give the message ना? You can give the message in a different way also. Then why you are bringing Sunny Leone in that? Or different model? आप super model को लेके आते हैं. Situation सोचें आप लोग. आप बच्चों के साथ. आप सिचुएशन सोचे आप सिचुएशन सोचे कि यू आर वॉचिंग टीवी विद योर डॉटर विद योर सन और उसके उस टाइम पर न्यूज देखते हुए बीच में एक सनी लियोनी का एड आता है और उसमें वो बात करती है स्किन के बारे में टेक्सचर के बारे में आप क्या एम्बेरस फील नहीं कर रहे हैं और उसके बाद आज आज इंडस्ट्री को प्रमोट करने के लिए देर इज सेंसर बोर्ड ऑल्सो वट वॉज सेंसर बोर्ड डूइंग एट दट टाइम गवर्नमेंट ने ओके गवर्नमेंट ने बात कर रहे हैं यू मेड योर पॉइंट यू आर सेंग इट्स लीजी You cannot watch it with exactly. your children. Exactly. Therefore, it needs to go. Amber, vulgarity. Uh, see, as a kid, uh, uh, Acharya Ji was talking about the, this Nero. That as as a kid, I never decoded what 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 is the ad is about. I used to ask my father and mother, "Mummy, ad kya hai? Mummy, ad kya hai? Why why Goda is running? See, see, see. This is not against the state. See, we are not against the education. This is the way to educate. 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 This is the way is just, just uh, on the sea shore she is lying and you are you are you are selling this thing on a I'm tv channel what, what, this I'm is vulgarity Achari this is vulgarity and you want to see let no 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 let me just come if you that. want Achari to see if you want to learn the things there are so many other things Achari you can learn the things you, 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 you are raising a wrong issue no, you are raising a wrong issue Achari you want to learn this let the women on this panel speak as well please i am not against them no if you are not against them let them speak ek minute just a minute just a minute see what are the rules of this debate i understand that screaming and shouting can be very entertaining exactly. but by the end of it no one at least no, yes, you know i don't think I, i don't take away anything are, from the debate so just to make a show eight minute if you are if the, the something something eight is minute. not going on in a, in a proper minute. manner आप सुन लीजिए आप सुन लीजिए आप यू स्क्रीमिंग एंड शाउटिंग लेट अंबर लेट अंबर अंबर गो आई वाज जस्ट सेइंग दैट एज एज अ कीड आई वाज नॉट एबल टू डिकोड द मैसेज ऑफ दिस एड द निरो दैट ही इज टॉकिंग अबाउट आई यूज्ड टू आस्क माय पेरेंट्स व्हाट व्हाट इज दिस एड अबाउट एंड माय माय मदर यूज्ड टू से दिस इज द चॉकलेट एड दिस इज द व्हाट एड एंड दिस दैट सो मैसेज शुड बी क्लियर आई वाज अ कीड आई सेड एज अ कीड कितनी एज की थी आप आई डोंट रिमेंबर एग्जैक्ट इवन इवन मेरे 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 बच्चे भी मेरे बच्चे भी इस वक्त उसी वो सनी लियोनी का ऐड नहीं समझते हैं दे आस्क मी कि क्या है ये दे आस्क मी क्या है वो आज ही नहीं सोच रहे हैं इफ यू वांट टू नहीं नहीं आज ही ऑफ दे लेट मी लेट मी टॉक टू योर चिल्ड्रन अबाउट सेक्स दे आर सो अदर थिंग्स दे आर सो दे आर सो मेनी अदर वेज यू कैन लेट देम लर्न यू कैन एजुकेट देम इन सो मेनी अदर वेज व्हाई टू व्हाई टू एजुकेट देम इन दिस मैनर यू आर सेलिंग द सेक्स यू आर सेलिंग सेक्स You are selling sex. 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 You are selling 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 sex. You are selling
Hi, I think uh, you know I uh, have a very fair say towards uh, this particular ban. I think the ban should be justified on the quality of the ad. Yeah. Exactly. Selling yeah. sexism yeah. on a general yeah. channel yeah. is yeah. not fine. Yeah. You have to have these ads going on air, but with a more aesthetical body language or with a more aesthetical script, a classy script, which therefore does not embarrass yeah. the parents. The At the time, same time, you know, we cannot the ban the ad completely. I don't think it's right to be yes. banning the ad completely. Because exactly. uh, we are taking exactly. away a share of huge knowledge from the teenagers who require this knowledge the most. Uh, we are taking away a huge share of uh, this uh, particular knowledge from the uneducated sector who live in our exactly. country. So here, here I want to speak like because see this is a fast um, generation. You know, teenage pregnancy is on run. I'm telling you, people like yes. the children should be educated of yes, saying safe sex. So it. why they should, should there be, be bad? I it. think the type guidelines should mm. be on the type of content. Exactly. The nudity Correct. should the not be promoted, yeah. but be the controlled. message should be so given clearly. Uh, exactly. The photo should, should be clear. Clear. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. There are so many ads on deodorants. There are so many ads on soft drinks. You know, they are also very provocative. But it's like you know, banning. Okay, 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 okay. So here's the thing. Here's the thing. Just come in here, Amber. Yes. I agree with what Vikramaditya is saying. He's saying it becomes embarrassing when you're seeing half, you're watching a news channel or a general entertainment channel and there are half naked women who are frolicking around the beach. Yes, does it, you know, does it spark the curiosity in a child who's watching that ad? It does. See. But is it the best way to do it? And, and, and the point also is, was the government absolutely illogical in putting those ads, not regulating them, but putting those ads at a time when no one is watching. There so you are effectively no killing point. the message. I am anything. saying children should get more exposed, exposed to it and they should be asking more questions about it. They mm. should be aware about the safe sex and uh, this uh, teenage pregnancy. But you are fine, fine with the sort of ads that are currently no, no, on television. No, no, I'm not, I'm not okay with this content, the, the type of content that I'm not in favor of uh, uh, this, uh, what do you call it, the vulgarity, they are uh, so, uh, so promoting vulgarity. Actually, or it's see, branding. The content, basically exactly, it's they are branding. branding. The, the yeah, government yeah. was saving a huge amount of money of the, the concept their, the, of these ads coming in the play. So everyone agrees. I think all of us yes. agree yeah, here. The problem is with the same type thing. of ads that are being put out. So, so, so it's all right. Okay. Essential for these ads to come on air. Absolutely. Because we in can't India, can't apply this we have parenthood. We have parents who are extremely smart things like this and explaining it to children. Correct. Correct. Parents, Where do parents, parents in India, just a minute. Where do parents in India, Vikram Aditya ji, they talk to their children about sex and safe sex? Ma'am, they don't. You they are don't. So in a therefore, one minute. So therefore, for a government, for a government, just just a minute, Shelly. Just a minute, Sanjana. Just a minute, Sanjana. Yes, Sanjana. Some of them, they will be like, seek lenge. Ham kya? Just a minute, Sanjana. I have a joke. Attitude which is very dangerous for the teenagers. Yeah, just which, let me complete uh, my point. Just let me complete my to, point. Uh, uh, the point is, this is the government of India. Sanjana, just a minute. <laughs> this is Acharya Vikramaditya, the government of India. Yeah. That decides in all its wisdom not to regulate the ads. Uh, not yeah. to regulate the content. I but but just to push ban. it exactly yeah. to a I time think, when I no one this is, is watching. This Do you agree I, that the government was wrong? I agree. This thing, this instead this of banning the things, we can present them in a nice manner, in a 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 and the owners of the TV channels and the most educated persons. And you know, from last so many years, these ads are running on the TV, and you never raise the voice just because of the commercial, just because of the money, because the channels are getting, because the channels are getting the money. You are selling sex just because of the money, just because of the commercial things. Instead of raising, government is now the government is raising the voice. They are, they are making, they are making. You, whenever the things, so the government. 
पूरी संस्कारी ब्रिगेड जो मीडिया कर रही है ना मीडिया के जिस तरह अखबार के द्वारा जिस तरह से प्रमोशन हो रहा है सेक्स का उसकी वजह से वर्गैलिटी सेक्स जितनी जो जितनी वो ज्यादा हो रहा है ये बात सुनिए आदित्य जी वाई आर यू स्क्रीमिंग एंड नॉट लेटिंग वेमेन ऑन दिस पैनल नो नो जस्ट अब आप अब दो मिनट अब आप दो मिनट चुप रही है और आप मेरी एक बात सुनिए एक मिनट एक मिनट दो मिनट अब आप एक स्टेटिस्टिक सुन लीजिए ये आप सबको जा, आपको स्पेशली जानने के लिए जरूरी है आपको पता है इस देश में कॉन्ट्रसेप्टिव यूज हैज डिक्रीज बाय 33 परसेंट इन द लास्ट एट इयर्स वॉट डज दैट चेज दैट इज ओनर्स ऑफ सेफ सेक्स द ओनर्स ऑफ बिकमिंग प्रेगनेंट और नॉट बिकमिंग प्रेगनेंट द ओनर्स ऑफ अ फैमिली रिप्रोडक्टिव हेल्थ इज ओनली ऑन द वुमन गुस्सा करने के लिए और भी बहुत चीजें वेट उन्नी कृष्णन प्लीज गो अहेड ये Uh, to a great extent, yes, advertising yeah. is one of the say, most I just strongest want to make my opinion on this. Sanjana, you just a minute. And your question was that is this condom is responsible for it? Sanjana, just a minute. This is responsible for it. Sanjana, just a minute. We have a call to happen. That is fine, but that doesn't mean you ban this ad and you shut all the eyes of the teenagers who are sitting at home and have no brains. Mr. Oni Krishnan. Mr. Oni Krishnan, good evening. Mr. Oni Krishnan, I'm sorry. Yes. I have not been able to hear what you. You are saying because my panelists were speaking. Please go ahead. Good evening. Thank you for joining our us on Epicenter. Please go ahead. Yeah. Can I? Yes. Can I say something? Yes, Mr. Yes. Nikrishan. Go ahead. I was just making an opinion in respect of uh, Acharya Vikramaditya's, you know, the, the words. Hmm. I'm surprised to see that you know the the way he is uh, uh, opposing this view or views expressed by the women in the panel. Hmm. It's obviously he is really becoming another avatar of Asaram Bapu and uh, Ram Rahim. There is no other view here. It's an anti-women position. It's an anti-women position. I think these Acharyas are demolishing the ancient democratic rights in this country. The country is going to deep trouble by virtue of this Acharyas' intervention in in social life. They should really. Uh, devote their time only for uh, praise okay. and uh, you Because know the news channel is calling me that's why, why i am coming off my own activity. basically so i am hey, i am on these that issues is complete, this complete. is this is a major issue this is a larger issue uh. this is all dealing with uh, equality man woman equality and he is okay. trying to really persecute Trans- women by way of expressing these kind of views okay, i think Anukrishan. you should be very careful of this kind of this kind of black sheep okay mr oni krishnan thank you very much ashok pandit filmmaker joining us on the phone line as well and then vikramaditya ji i am coming to you with a question uh, yes mr pandit good evening to you please go ahead sure uh, i very strongly feel that this is a very serious matter and the ban on anything is absolutely wrong uh you can you can uh, supervise the content and the quality of the film the way the exactly. message is given yes exactly that we is have, the point we have, hmm. we have we have great filmmakers in this country we have great script writers in this country we have great creative directors in this country hmm. who can really do a best possible job in this country to promote condoms hmm. now 
that, 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 that as, uh, you know, I, I was listening to Vikram Aditya Ji, that vulgarity, now, who, who has given the right to anybody for, uh, to decide or define what is vulgarity? Hmm. For me, something, hmm. some, some visual can be, can be proper, for somebody it can be vulgar. So, let us not get into the debate and discussion of vulgarity or not okay. vulgarity. Okay. We have great talented people in the country. It's a very hmm. serious issue. I think, so. I think it's concentrate a very, on message. A very important what issue which should be, you know, looked into. Okay. Thank you very much for joining us. Good point you make. Who decides what is vulgar? Exactly. I will say Khajuraho ke temples mein vulgarity bhari hai. Exactly. Should we break down all those temples? It's your mind. It's, it's the state true. of mind we perception. You have seen, you have seen, you have seen the Khajuraho temples. We are an idea of Kama Sutra. When I started, I raised the first question. I gave you an example that Kama Sutra is a scripture written by... No, Khajuraho ke temple, agar, agar, the way you are presenting the things on the TV, that you, you are sitting with the family members and over there the Sunny Leone is coming with the so such sort of vulgar why, why, why what is the, it What is your impression? Why, 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 you are sitting with your father and I ask a simple question. You are sitting with your children, you are sitting with your father and Sunny Leone is coming on the screen with such sort of ad. She is half light, half Leone, half half. Is your problem with the ad? No, no, my, my, this is a presentation. You have to give a message. If you want to give the message, give it in a nice way. There are so many things that people are saying. My point is, I'm not with the man. आप सनी लियोने के पीछे क्यों पड़ गए? Why you are bringing ladies in the ad? Why you are bringing ladies in the ad? If the condom is a male product, why you are bringing ladies in the ad? Oh my God! See this is why you are bringing ladies in the ad? Why? 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 Just give me reason. Just give me reason. Why? 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 Why
This one of it. This one of it. You are making this ad. You are making this ad. You are making this ad. You are making this ad for the commercial purpose for selling this comment. And what is the problem in that? No, no, no. You have to. What is the problem? So my point is, you have to present the things in a decent manner. So you have to present the things in a decent manner. So you have to present the things in a decent manner. And you are not doing it. You are not presenting things in a decent manner. You are not presenting things in a decent manner. You are not presenting the things in a new. You are presenting a new idea. <coughs> just a minute, See, just a minute, Sanjana. This is an internet okay. age. Okay, 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 okay. I Eight think minutes. so. Girls and boys pre-mature. Six years, six years, five what years, it is. and ten below ten years. But Sanjana, that's what I'm saying. Sanjana, go ahead. Why? Just See, a minute. See, what I want is like Sanjana. This huh. Ad or this product should not be banned from being telecasted or advertised. Hmm. Rather, the approach has to be a lot more responsible. Like how we have Narendra Modi coming in and talking about the Swachh Bharat Abhiyan everywhere. Why you are banning the cigarette? Then the same thing. Like how we have Amitabh Bachchan talking about the Swachh Bharat Abhiyan. We need to so have a more respectful thing. On one side, when you are banning the advertisement of the Gurkha Pan Masala, then they are also harmful. We are banning the thing. Why should we be allowed to ban? You want to protect the country? Show her the eyes and show her. No, no, no. You see the population. You are arguing with me. But the condom ads are a compulsion on national television yes, yes. to control population, so to control diseases, to guide the nation. No, no, no. Ambers, 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 Ambers. Previously, was saying that the, I was not able to understand the ad of the Nero. I was not able to understand. Exactly. I was not able to understand. Now you can understand. Now the when the Sunny Kumar is coming or any porn star is coming, now you can understand the things. And another, the way they are presenting the news, now you can understand. So you want to understand the thing? So why don't you? 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 Why uh, Venkat, good uh, evening to you. This debate is getting heated. Good of you to call us. Good evening. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, thank you very much for giving me this uh, opportunity. Banning uh, condom ad is a very bad thing because it uh, almost all encourages uh, the diseases that are spreading violently in the okay. least developed countries. In yeah. India, there is a rampant prostitution whether people agree or not. Mm. Yes. But if they are not using any kind of safety procedures, Mm. Then it is going to be very uh, STD uh, and also going to explode. So these things should be kept in mind by by the government. It's not just about vulgarity or anything. Mm. It is the diseases and who are getting infected. Mm. Previously, government, despite government many ads, what the Sanskari ads are there, nothing has happened. But the diseases got exploded, mm. exploded, and many okay. people have died. Okay. Because okay. Because they Venkat. couldn't afford the treatment. All right. Venkat, so the point you are making is people should encourage is... this one. They should not ban. Okay. Okay. First of all, there is no ban. I mean, we are. I, I know all panelists have used the word ban, ban. There has been no ban. Uh, condom okay. ads have been relegated to the 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. Yeah. Uh, slot. So that's, that's, that's a time when no one is watching essentially. Uh, so my closing comments, just a minute, just a minute. My closing comments, I'm running out of sh uh, time. Closing comments, Sanjana Galrani, 20 seconds yes. closing comments. I think you should have a more responsible person like how Narendra Modi comes and talks about Swachh Bharat. You have Amitabh Bachchan talking about polio. Hmm. Like that a responsible woman in the country should come and talk about the uses of a condom. And uh, it has to be used Good. in the right but limelight. But what is the problem with Sunny Leone? Exposing like that. But what is she, the problem with Sunny Leone? A message in a way. She is. She is. <laughs> because there's a lot of success watching. Sure, I think on Sunny Leone is the highest googled uh, lady it, 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 over the internet, and you are saying Sunny. Closing comments, Amber Zadi. You were responding to her. See, I'm saying that we should we should not be banning such uh, such ad in daytime. We should uh, the children. The primary concern was uh, was this that children should not get exposed. I I think children should get more exposed to it, yeah, and there should be obviously be. safe sex education. And we are already not in place with the, uh, the awareness. And, and should anyone have a problem with someone like a Sunny Leone doing? No, I don't. I, I don't have any problem with Sunny Leone. Or 
beat so anyone else. Google exactly. Google 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 Google
Welcome back. Ruling the airwaves today has been a video of the late Jay Jay Lalita that shows her in hospital sipping juice. The 22nd clip released by the TTV Dinakaran camp right ahead of the crucial RK Nagar bypass, which is tomorrow, scheduled for tomorrow, was aimed at pulling in some sympathy votes and to tell the world that there was no foul play in Amma's death. The question is, will it work? Take a look. A 20-second dramatic new video showing former Tamil Nadu Chief Minister J. Jai Lalitha in the Apollo Hospital. A frail and weak-looking Jaya is seen watching TV from her hospital bed. At one point, she is also seen sipping a drink from a paper cup. The man who released this video is S. Vetrival, a former MLA and a close confidant of TTV Dinakaran. He says this video was shot by Sasikala, Amma's close aide, just after she was shifted from the ICU to her private room at Apollo. This video was shot by Chinnamma after Amma came out from ICE ward, ICU ward. It is not clear what Jaya is watching on TV, but it appears like some religious program, something that Sasikala had said earlier, Jaya Lalita liked to do. On that day, she even watched TV. TV Every day, Amma used to watch at least two or three episodes. She was very fond of old Tamil songs. So again, I would record old Tamil songs, black and white, old songs. She used to love them. I used to bring that to the Apollo Hospital and show that to Amma. There are also photographs of various gods just beside her hospital bed. Jaya does not seem to be on any form of life support, but she has a blood pressure monitoring band on her right hand. She seems conscious and alert, but there seems to be a significant colour difference between both her hands, something that people of RK Nagar have called into question. In the hospital, there is a third floor. 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 There is a poison guard. There is a treatment. So he is saying that the video does not look authentic. He also says that it does not look like it was shot inside Apollo hospitals. Why is it not? Why is it not? So he's saying that he still cannot decide whether the video is fake or whether the video is for real. This may be true only, madam. We can see this video itself. We can see no. This may be true only. The actions all belongs to that video. It may be true only. That is all, madam. Social media, Facebook, WhatsApp, and the matter. All the time, on the room, pound the value are wrong. That's why the younger youngsters. Kaman or samanya makhluk itu patuh unma namba matang. Orsila orang pelik ada erkira orang orang nambu orang. Indah mari ana arasil sulit segala ini dah lama. So he is also saying that the video looks fake and it could have been using a lot of technologies. He also says that this was to ensure that people who are in a dilemma whether to vote for the AI DMK or the TTV faction, they are trying to use this video to garner votes just ahead of RK Nagar by pull. The timing of the release of this video is certainly suspect, coming just on the eve of the RK Nagar bipole in which TTV Dinakaran is a contestant. Let's look at the implications of this video. This video could emotionally appeal to some of the voters in RK Nagar. It also sets to rest speculation about foul play in Jaya's death. This video could be used as we are seeing Jay Jayalalata being used right ahead of the RK Nagar bypolls that are scheduled for tomorrow. Uh, Dhania Rajendran is the editor-in-chief of the newsminute.com. She is joining me on Skype this evening. Hello to you, Dhania. Good evening. Uh, you know, there are, there are people including Deepa Jayaraman who are raising a question about the authenticity of this video. It looks pretty real to me. Well, I think the authenticity of the video is not a great question. Yeah, I, I doubt anyone would go to such a sense to make a fake video. The problem is that there is, uh, there is urban legend in Tamil Nadu that uh, general trust stores have been amputated, which is the reason why a lot of people don't want to believe the video. But that, like I said, is only an urban legend. No one really knows the truth. Mm -hmm. And doctors have continuously said that no hotels have never been amputated. Mm -hmm. uh, coming to the other point, which I think uh, Ujima was asking a lot of voters in Nazi Nagar, Hmm. Would the release of this video a day before really help you to be hmm. There were posters being released by Madhusudan's camp uh, saying, asking questions about the LSA set. It is only to counter those posters that this video has been released. Hmm. What I don't understand is that in the past 12 months, whenever anyone has asked Sashikala's family about the video, they clearly said that we respect Jairus' privacy and we do not want to malign her after her death. We do not want to put such a video out. Mm. It shows her in a safe condition hospital. Mm. So what changed now? Uh, has, has a respect for Jairus' privacy suddenly vanished into thin air? Mm. 
Hmm. Is really one constituency uh, more important than hmm. general constituency all of a sudden? Hmm. Hmm. Dhanya, also another question. I mean, you know, the electorate is smarter than politicians tend to think that they are. Uh, will the release of this video actually really have any impact on the polls tomorrow? What's your assessment? That would be, that would be tough to predict. But I'm sure there would be a section of people who would now question Adipati Palmi Swami and Old Palmi Salam and their ministers who continuously raise questions on whether there is was uncon- hmm. uh, uh, unconscious throughout of her hospitalization. So there would be, of course, one section of people who press the EPA and OPA. There would be another section of people mm-hmm. who believe that the video is fake. Like, out of the four sound bites you guys had, I think two of them said, no, the video is fake. Mm-hmm. So, Mr. as far as the Shashikala family is concerned, is so entrenched that mm-hmm. people do not even want to believe a video, even if it's true. Mm. That's very well put, Danya. Thank you very much. Always good to come to you on stories like this. Thank you very much for being here on Epicenter. With that, I'm slipping into a quick break on the show. Up next, crime show host turns criminal. The host of India's Most Wanted gets life in jail for the murder of his wife. This murder happened 17 years ago. What is Soheb Ilyasi saying about it? That's coming up next. Do stay with us.